Hey guys, this is gotcha. Ivan's full journey. He stayed oh, three full weeks, by the way. And we were doing so good, we even tried an occiput adjustment on him, which may have gone south a bit. I think it's what he needed, and I think he did better for it, but he wasn't so hot on it. I will let you guys be the judge. Tell me, did you think I helped him or hurt him? Let me know. Uh, I'm here because I've been experiencing uh, lightheadedness, dizziness, uh, I get headaches too. This all started from uh, since September 3rd. Uh, I went to Six Flags and uh, after two weeks from, from Six Flags on September 3rd, uh, I started experiencing headaches. I thought it was stress but it got worse and worse throughout the, the year and then it's built up to migraines and finally around May. <clears throat> It was like a ticking time bomb, and I got the lightheadedness for the first time ever in my life. I forgot about the car accident. Neurologist, ENT. ENT, right? Uh, general practitioner. Yes. Uh, vestibular therapy. Uh, first chiropractor was a sports chiropractor. They started causing more of an imbalance in my spine, so then I started getting more dizzy. I let them go, and I went to a Gonstead. Yeah, this this one, the five-star chiropractor, a lot of great it's reviews. A I'd have to go every week, every single week, and then minimal improvement. Headaches, uh, I have them about three to, three to five times a week. And then you have migraines often? Uh, once a week. And I'd have to sleep a lot to feel re- Look at the ground. How about that? Uh, stood four. Four, look at the ceiling. How about that? Uh, dizzy. Stand up on your toes for five seconds. Okay. Jesus. <laughs> bad balance, yeah, right? It's really bad, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Your neck should be shaped like this yellow line. This arrow points to where I focus my attention. This arrow points to something kind of interesting. But this is almost acting like they're fused together. You see how this atlas is, is flat down here? Yeah. And it's all ground away down here. This bone wears out this bone. We've learned what's going on with him, again, from taking notes. He brought this notebook. He spends a lot of time writing stuff in here, but this helps me, helps me understand patterns in him. And those patterns help me understand how to change things. So um, he uh, had a pattern of having pain when he sat and um, maybe some pain in the morning a little bit and maybe some pain when he stands, but we taught him how to a challenge, the challenge of that and how to change that with the, again, exercise we do. And so the notes are helping us understand how it all works. So anyways, be prepared to take notes, guys. Uh, less of the symptoms, uh, primarily because of the, the posture uh, you taught me to do. Um, I, you know, whenever I felt it le cur um, leaping, you know, coming coming on, uh, I'd stop myself and you just remember what you taught me. Gotcha. And then, you know, I didn't, it didn't escalate anymore. Okay, so we're gonna do this first Atlas adjustment, guys. Uh, Ivan, he's not really, he talked a lot more a few minutes ago. He's a little nervous about this Atlas adjustment. So what, 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 why are you so nervous, dude? Uh, this is, it's more direct connected to, to the brainstem. Absolutely. More, more direct to the cerebellum and I've, you know, it could either do, I mean, based on what I've heard, it could, um, people that it could do, <laughs> it could do really good, it could be real bad. So. Well, I'll try to turn the real good on. Okay. But we'll see. My hand's been a little shaky lately. Oh, man. Don't, uh, <laughs> no, no, no. I shouldn't have drank so much last night. Uh, then we, could, we could do this another day. Then. <laughs> Slide right onto that atlas. Remember, line of drive is very important when you adjust. It's easy to slide down to C2, but C1 is right there. You can feel that I'm on it. And we just going to put them in here, and you got to drive the... Oh. Right through there. Ooh. Oh, that was stronger. I felt it high. High, huh? Really high. <laughs> yeah. And so uh, you can still wiggle your toes, right? Yeah. How about your fingers? Oh, good, 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 good. Okay. That's the first. <laughs> That's the first. See, it's always trying to pop. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and so, Ivan, what happened? You didn't write hardly any notes. Why? Uh, no pain, no symptoms. Um, as far as like the ones that's always like constant is like, um, I mean, for this week was the pain on the on the slat traps. Um, I woke up this morning, it wasn't there. And what do you say? What did you say about that? You said this morning. You, I mean, you said when you woke up, you're like, what? What do you think of it when you didn't when you didn't feel that? I was like, where is it? I miss it. Like, I miss my pain. <laughs> and this is first time. Gotcha. Oh. Hey. Oh, that was more easier, actually. Wow, this side's tight. Lower that left shoulder. Good. Oh. Wow. Whew. I still think there's something missing up in this atlas, so we're going to work on a little more. Okay. Good.
little nugget up here. I can oh. feel it. <laughs> here's the atlas right there. And here's his jaw right there. This is how close they are. <laughs> and what's the laughter from? It always feels like you're gonna knock me out or something. I try. I'm trying. <laughs> Comparison, I feel like I got more, I would say, more progress, better better balance. I'm not moving as much. Um, I'd say the first week, if you just stayed the first week, I don't think you would. Mm, you, I don't know if you'd see, right, based, on, based on my experience, I didn't see like. I was barely getting to that place where I'm like, okay, now we're getting getting momentum going. But then if you just stop, it'd be like... How do you feel this week? How do, where are you at right now? Uh, overall, how much better do you think you are? I'd say about 70, 70% 70 better. Gotcha. Yeah. And so how much have you learned here? We adjusted you a ton and you feel better from the adjustments. Have you learned something while you're here too? A lot. Posture, how to walk, how to sit, how to, um, you know, different variations of like when I'm, scenarios like when I'm eating, sitting down, or when I'm in the living room sitting. Um, if you brought his girlfriend, I would have taught him how to do that too. <laughs> <laughs> Look at she got that one. <laughs> Hi, you speak English. I hear. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> uh, I was like, this is like, oh, I got a good joke. I can't wait. Just finish it. I'm going to interject it right now. Those note notes taking, like, we figure out the culprit behind things, you know. That's so taking mean. notes is a good thing? Yes. Yes. I can't talk. Balancing. <laughs> I'm talking to somebody who's too chicken to take a video. He's from Canada. And, yeah, you can hear him barking back there. And so he's learned a lot here, but he's too chicken to share how great this whole experience is. Um, I think it's age. He doesn't. He thinks he's old. He's lost all his hair. He's, those, those Canadians, not very good looking. So I think oh that's what he's worried God. about. <laughs> <laughs> you came here for vertigo. Uh, business. Sixty percent better. Gotcha. Uh, right arm, wrist thing. Blah blah blah. blah. Gone. Gone. Uh, headaches three to five times a week. Gone. Gone. Migraines once a week. That's gone. Uh, brain fog. Brain you had fog. it yesterday. It came had it back. Yesterday, yeah. Because you know why? Because he watched stupid freaking purge for goddamn yeah. twelve hours. That's why. Because that <laughs> stuff melts your goddamn brain. So, anyways, he had a little brain fog. I told him it's because of the way he sat, so we fixed that up. Uh, sleep. How's your sleep been sleep. doing? Oh, sleep's perfect. Anxiety, depression, all uh, better. Hey, hey, I got one. Antisocial. What do you think? Are you the shit out here? You're like walking around like, hey, babe. Nice. Hey, what's going on? Hey, I'm from Chicago. <laughs> you want to go see the Windy City? Yeah, I think that ruined my posture. So. Uh, <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. I guess I don't do it right when I do this. So that's, my, that's my swag. My, that's my... Pro social position. <laughs> you gotta give them different angles. So again, to pick up girls, you can't just come in square. You gotta give them angles. <laughs> yeah, see, you gotta change the angles up because you know all guys come in square, heavy. You know, you gotta come in like it's like almost like you're shooting a gun. You got you can't come in full exposure. You come in so you could miss. <laughs> Anyways, so I don't know where that came from. So vision, vision, vision. Uh, there's still little floaters there here and there, but not as bad as when I came. Okay, yeah. to ring in ears gone. every day. Gone. Ring in ears. Tinnitus, guys. Tinnitus is gone. Okay. Excellent. He was complaining about a little bit of residual pain that shoots up into his right side when we adjust his atlas on the right. And so I did that over and over again. Now it wasn't really, it wasn't going away. So we tried an oxygen adjustment and lo and behold, things kind of went off the rail. So new things happen, pain happened, he didn't sleep last night. Everything's been, that was going good, went off again the rail. 10 times, I guess, more intense for me than yeah. it was compared to the atlas. Sure. Um, so then um, he felt unbelievably felt, better at first yeah and then it felt and then afterwards i guess um i started having pain and from there i forgot everything i just got <laughs> he made he forgot all the things all the teachings i taught him wow Whew. that's tight that sucker's tight So I'm gonna get here and just knock some of this pressure down in his neck right here. He loves this. See his face? <laughs> he loves this. 
And what I'm doing is I'm pushing on the suboccipital muscle on the right side, just inferior to the occiput. Um, just superior to C1, right in that groove right here. And so we're doing this because, again, I set that occiput so deep that the muscle spasms me a little bit. We had a setback, which I think we had. Did we do a video on that already? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Video, yeah. And so he said back we did an occiput adjustment on him. Uh, I think it's exactly what he needs, um, but we uh, opened it and went a little too firm, and so he's still uh, having some repercussions from that. Uh, first three weeks, two weeks, they were amazing. Uh, progress was, uh, I would say, exponential for me. Um, definitely, I would, if I had stopped at the two week mark, I would have been like, I'm like, hell yeah, I'm like, you know, like, keep coming back but I'm not saying I'm not coming back but uh, He's not coming back. <laughs> uh, just the third week when we did the occiput adjustment uh, I think I mentioned that it was a little bit it was way extreme compared to the atlas uh, and I guess I just freaked out over it so then I just lost control couldn't sleep uh, anxiety came back uh, yeah pretty much just everything flew out the window at that point and but like Dr. A, uh, A said, it's it's calmed down, but it's not still how it was before. Yeah, and so uh, sometimes you do these things, and so I always say you have to take chances to make things go a lot better. But sometimes those chances they backfire on you a little bit, and so you guys always want to come back and come in and say, oh well, you know, just do what you need to do, Dr. Thayer, right off the bat. The reason I don't is just because of this. I thought he was as stable as could be, so I could take a chance to do more. But again, it happened. Uh, you came in primarily think vertigo. So where are you with the vertigo, by the way? Oh, I haven't even noticed that, yeah. Yeah, that was a primary yeah. issue, so he's better there, okay? Uh, right arm, right wrist. Oh, that's gone. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so, uh, headaches, three to five times a week. Uh, <clears throat> most of the, before, I mean, this week, probably because of the sleep, but it's not as extreme headaches like before. How's your brain fog today? I feel clear today. Yeah. After that other adjustment, it, it got better. How's your anxiety today? Uh, it's, it's better, it's better. It's okay, like over, a six, six out of ten. Is that better or six out of ten bad? Uh, it was, it's better because uh, if you remember, I, I, like, I was afraid to go out. I'm able to, I guess, communicate better with people. You're oh, the ring that's gone. Yeah. yeah. And then uh, vision. Vision. I don't know the vision was. What was the vision problem? Mm, I don't see as much floater as before. Yeah, yeah. Uh, no, I would say that based on my other experiences with other chiropractors, his is like the most intense and I guess more progress. You get more progress out of it. Uh, definitely a lot of improvements. Good, right there. So Ivan, how is this different than this morning? This adjustment. Uh, more relaxed, definitely. Yeah, so I don't even feel the anxiety that much right now. So now you'll come back? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, yeah, it's loose. Yes. Dude, I, I, I know what I'm doing. Just, sorry, sorry. I that, know, it's just that. Sorry, it's not in a straight line <laughs> like you like. You just get skeptical, you know, like when it goes wrong, you're like, fuck. Like, you know, just yeah. want to, yeah. But, yeah, it's, no, it's, no. It's like your girlfriend, you know. <laughs> I can do it again. Come on, I did it once before. <laughs> no, no, no. It, it, I'm not lying. It's, it does, does feel better, though. It does feel better. Yeah, and so he's doing better. You can even see it in his eyes. He's back. <laughs> Ivan. Ivan's back. <laughs> you can see it. I feel relaxed. Thank you yeah, so much. You're welcome, man. Good. See you guys next time.